Hi guys, today I am going to share with you my thoughts on the Dehancer plugin, a review and a little secret on how to make anything look like a real cinematic movie with this plugin. This plugin is available for different uh, editing programs, including DaVinci Resolve, Final Cut, After Effects or Premiere Pro, as well as Photoshop and Lightroom. This is an unpaid video, you will hear a really honest opinion about this plugin. So, as for me, the Hanser is a great tool for those who are making videos and do color correction. I will show you the features of this plugin and give you a discount code that you can use when you buy this plugin if you like it. I work in DaVinci Resolve, so this tutorial will be about working with the Hanser in this program. We open DaVinci. I usually do color grading with my own LUTs, but recently I've been using this plugin as well. Normally the Hanser plugin node should be placed at the end, then other additional correction nodes and uh, local masks uh, can be added before the Dehancer node. This is what a typical node layout example looks like. I usually use only curves to return color to video that was shot in log mode. I give it an S shape like this and the color comes back along with the contrast. It's important that the curves are exactly in this mode when all channels work together. In many cases I only need two nodes, one for curves and one for the Hanser Pro. I mean exactly this version of the plugin. There are so many settings and we can edit everything in one place. First of all I choose one of the profiles in the film tab. Let it be this profile. If we need to increase the temperature, we can create a separate node for it, but just do it in the input tab. We can also adjust the exposure, but as I said, I do it with curves. In the Film Developer tab I add a color boost value. Adjust the highlights using Film Compression. In the Expand tab you can change the white point and the black point. When we need to get a nice black and white video, we can achieve it with the print tab, disappear saturation and adjust other settings to get the version of the image that we like the most. Also we can thin the video here, open the color head tab and adjust these settings. We can choose the tone of the shadows, mid-tones and highlights separately. My favorite dehancer features are grain, halation and bloom. With help of these effects it's possible to achieve a cinematic look and uh, in some cases to refuse special filters. Grain adds atmosphere and also I really like bloom and halation. Finally, we can export the LUT which contains all the settings except some effects. In addition, there is also a mobile version of the Hanser. With help of this application you can also edit your video in just a few clicks. Let's try. Select and upload the video to the program, choose a preset. 
and we can edit it. Next, we export the video to the gallery. It's super quick and easy. And now the most pleasant part. With this promo code you can get your discount when you buy the Hanser. In the description of this video I will leave a link. By clicking on it you can take the first step to using this great plugin. Also, on December 16, the acceptance of applications for video works for the Dehancer Colorist Awards ends. There are many nominations here, you may still have time to submit your work. I wish you success! Write in the comments if you have already dealt with Dehancer and how you like the result that can be achieved with it. Have a nice day!